my friends, Bearski here. If you ever want to get custom blades like these ones, or at the very least change the size and attributes of the sabers that you do have, the default ones, then follow along with this guide to make it a reality. But before we begin, I can only guarantee that this method works if you follow my previous guides on how to install moddable Beat Saber on Quest 2. This could also work if you install custom Beat Sabers another way, but it may not be able to help you if you run into any issues. This guide covers how to add custom swords while using a PC. You could use another device with a browser, but that would be for another video. Now let's get to it. To make things easier, open your Quest app and set power settings to 15 minutes. Your headset must stay on while adding the file to your headset. If you cannot change the power settings, then just keep the Quest 2 on top of your head while you perform the next actions. Next, we are going to get the mod that allows us to change the shape, size, tra trails, and 3D model of our saber. Go to BMBF. You should have BMBF installed if you follow my previous guide. And if you forgot how to get to BMF, you can find it through App Library, click the filter button in the top right, and go to Unknown Sources. If BMBF does not open within 20 seconds, just close the app and launch it again. Sometimes it has a little bit of issues starting, but it will open eventually. Now you are going to go to the browser tab, scroll down to Cosmetics Whackers, and click download. You should get a message that the mod is queued. Next, click Sync to Beat Saber in the top right corner. It's red. Mine says Start Beat Saber, as I already ran through this process while trying to figure out how to get the custom swords. Now we go to the Tools tab at the top of the BMBF window. We are going to make a note of the IP address displayed in the top right, right here. In my case, it was http colon slash slash 192.168.1.83 colon 50,000 slash. Be sure to note the http colon slash slash at the start and the slash at the end. Now go to your preferred browser. Enter the IP address that you just wrote down into the URL bar at the top. I've thrown an arrow here to show you what I mean by a URL bar. If you do not see this URL bar and you're using Google, you may be using Google's accessibility page. Just go to youtube.com, type click on any video, and then you'll see the URL bar at the top. This is where you enter that IP address that I told you about. If you forgot what the IP address was, remember it is the http colon slash slash number dot number dot number dot number colon another big number with a slash at the end. You must enter the exact IP address in order to get to the next page. The next page will look like this. Now, on another tab or window, click on the invite link in the description to get an invite to the QMod Cosmetics Discord server. If you wish to type it out, here it is. As of August 8th, 2023, this invite is valid. If things change, I'll be sure to update this in the description. Quick disclaimer, these so-called whacker files have not all been verified by the staff on the server or by myself. The community takes this service very seriously and will try to weed out any bad apples that wish to ruin it, but this is a use at your own caution and discretion on your quest to get custom blades. From here, scroll down the channels until you land on finished model hashtag whackers. Find the whacker, sword, saber, blade that tickles your fancy and download the file. Save this file wherever you want, perhaps even a folder on your desktop. Just anywhere on your computer that you know where it'll be so you don't lose it. Now go back to your tab or window that is HTTP colon slash slash lots of numbers page and drag that file right into the middle. If it is a valid whacker file, you will be greeted with a green file prompt pop-up. It even has a check part. And congratulations, you now have a custom saber floating around in Beat Saber. So now we boot up Beat Saber, click on settings, click on cosmetic settings, and you will see whackers. 
This is also where you find custom walls and cube skins. 